Let's take a look at these three similar terms. Heat is the energy transferred from one body to another because of a difference in temperature. So we usually talk about heat when it involves energy being transferred from one thing to another. Internal energy is the sum of all of the energy of all of the molecules in a stationary object. For example, for this pencil, its internal energy can include the kinetic energy of the atoms, molecules, and their constituents, and the chemical energy. You know, if I burn this pencil, I can release some chemical energy. And if you wish, you can also count the nuclear energy. But since we're talking about the energy in a stationary object, if this pencil is moving at the speed v, the kinetic energy one half times mass of the pencil times v squared would not be considered as part of the pencil's internal energy. Thermal energy is the part of the internal energy that results in the system's temperature. Since the temperature is proportional to the average kinetic energy, thermal energy would just be the kinetic energy of the little particles inside the pencil. The mechanical equivalent of heat is 4.186 joules equals to 1 calorie, or 4,186 joules equals to 1 large calorie, or 1 kilocalorie. This was measured in the mid-19th century by James Prescott Joule. In the 20th work and energy video lesson, I covered in more details on Joule's experiment. You can find the relevant links at my website. By the way, you do not have to memorize the, these unit conversions.